I'll actually use Earthquake, hoping that he brings in the next one. He barely took any damage. There comes the fourth one. Which is perfect, so now he takes the bunk of that damage too. Well, three big damage. There's not really any point in using Echo. Oh, he's healing himself. I'm like not taking any damage. It's ridiculous how easy this boss is this time. Ooh. Yeah, you take a lot of damage from that thing. He's using that on himself, so everyone's healing this turn. Alright, fence is back to normal. Jen has a bunch of pigeons to summon. I realize that Shiba has an oil drop, so I'll use that. Jenna's HP is kind of getting low. He must be pretty soon out. Take this. That didn't do much damage. He's not attacking this turn. And he's still alive somehow. And there he he's down. Jen has a level 14. Felix is level 14. He learned the Quake Sphere. And we got a veil from that. Well, that takes care of that. I'm willing to bet everyone. Win. Okay, yes, yeah, so everyone's gonna be happy. We lost. Even pirates have honor. Uncle Quietly, I won't make a scene just because I lost. Go on, hand us over to May to Madra or Al Hafa or whoever. Good. First off, you could tell that Madrarians, the man called Piers, is innocent. Fine. So what? I just have to say that Piers isn't one of my men? Wait! Can you find it in your heart to forgive Bruns and his men? Who are you? My name is Ch Chutra. Bridget's white, and he. So you're a pirate too. He's like, no, she has nothing to do with this. I know Brins and his men have caused some great trouble with their piracy, and I know their cram crimes cannot be ignored. How can you ask him to forgive them? The only reason Brins became a pirate was to help the people of Chapa. We Chapa are seafaring folks. Our livelihood depends entirely upon the sea. But in recent years, the sea has changed. We can't live the life we once could. The oceans have warmed, and the fish have vanished from our waters. The southern chapter is rocky and barren. No crops can be grown there. No crops! So you have no grain and no meat. It sounds like life in Chapa is hard. It's not hard, it's unbearable. Our children can't eat. Our pea village is dying. These men promised to return with food enough for all our people, but they found none. So we became pirates. And he says it's in, it's like right, yeah, like South e East and Grara, isn't that near Yanks and Lama Tempo? 
if you're a ghost out from there. That's so far away. Oh yeah, you think we could be successful pirates so close to home? If they raided any towns near Chapa, it would be obvious to all who the attackers were. And no one back home could forgive me if they knew, not even my grandmother. But where does that leave us? Are we simply to accept your looting here on Indra? I'm shocked, I tell you, shocked! What's so shocking? It looked like they really are pirates, just like you said. Mr. Mayor, I am appalled that you could not take our word for it. We probably wouldn't even have believed we were from Mandra if the mayor hadn't come. Am I supposed to believe the accusations of a complete stranger? Is this your position, Mayor? How can I expect to believe a tidal wave could wash Indra into Ossinia? Or that a group of men could walk on foot from Mandra all the way to Alhafra? It sounds to me like you had forgotten about us altogether. I'm not sure you remember the last time we met, do you? We met when I was just a child. It must have been more than 10 years ago now. 20 years! It's been 20 years since I last saw you. It's been a long time indeed. Can't blame for forgetting his face. Don't be silly, I didn't forget his face. His face merely changed. Interrupting your interruption. Would I be correct in assuming And then they tell us who they are, which we already know. I like how the mayor of Hal Hal is like the fat hog kind of guy. And I am a close personal friend of Sheen, whose lover was injured by the Chapa. Felix, Jenna, and Sheba. We fought Bridget's here, and they stole from Mandra. Ahem, and I was honestly taken aback to hear a businessman being slandered. They truly are pirates, then why would they go to the trouble of buying a ship from us? Because the very funds they used to purchase the ship were pillaged from our homes. If this ship was bought with Mandrarian gold, then it belongs to Mandrarians. What do you say? Fix everything? Where will you go? I won't run and I won't hide. Actually, I don't feel up for much of anything right now. Then you probably won't mind being locked up, will you? Prince! Don't worry, I'll be back. Take care, my kid. And he talks to us. Were you taking your boat then? Ship? You're worse than we ever were. Aren't you at least going to pay us for the boat? Why would they pay you when the money you used to buy the ship was stolen from them? Quiet, all you. Do as you must, but I have one request. You have to let well, his wife and his son to have weird names stay on the boat until it's repaired. And he goes, okay. You haven't done our half of any harm, Brins. And our prisoner Piers, is he one of your men? I don't know any Piers. Sounds to me like you made a pretty big mistake. See, it's just as I said, Piers is innocent. You must return to Mandra and free him immediately. Me? What? Alone? Only two of us will remain here. You can return to Mandra with the others. Understood. We'll return immediately. My mansion took a cup of tea. It's crazy. 
freedom. Then please come see me at my mansion before you go. So I would like to thank you for everything you've done. He doesn't give you any items, so don't waste your time going to see him. Why do I get the feeling the mayor of Alhafa prefers to deal with my father over me? Thank you all very much. My voice magically changed due to your efforts. Piers is going to be released. I'm just looking at the ship. I know this fine ship belongs to Madra. Okay, and he's like, he'll give us a reward. Um... Anyways, he's like, he'll give us a reward when um, the ship is fixed. And she doesn't. She's allowed to stay on her ship until. She married a pirate. So you so said we should try and find peers. So we have to try and fix the ship. Well, we'll have to fix the ship later, anyways, but. You can't fix it all now, but you might as well just do it. Now make sure you come do this. This is large bread. It's not power bread. So it doesn't put up your HP. It actually doesn't do any antenna. But you can give it to 